Keeping your kids safe all the time can be tricky when you cannot be with them always. Parents ensure the safety of their child at home, and teachers and caretakers are responsible for the kids' safety at school. But who keeps them safe on the road? Whether your children walk to school or take the bus, they should be taught about the rules to stay safe on roads. Unlike adults, children do not have the maturity to know what to do and what not when walking on the roads. Without adult supervision and proper knowledge of road safety rules, children can put themselves at risk. When it comes to the safety of your children, you should not compromise. Teach about road safety for children as soon as they are old enough to step out of the house. Ensure that they understand what you are saying by practicing it with them. Hi, I'm Ashish David and today I'll talk to you about 13 things that you can teach your children about road safety. This would also serve as a reminder and a warning to adults who could find this equally useful. While it is important for children to know about road safety rules and regulations, they should not be given more information than they can handle. Here are a few basic road safety rules for children that you can begin with. 1. Know your signals. Help your kids learn about traffic lights and signs and what each color indicates. Green means go. Only when the signal turns green, vehicles move ahead. Red means stop. When the signal turns red, all the vehicles have to stop. Yellow means slow down. When the signal turns yellow, vehicles should slow down and prepare to stop. Or a walking man symbol at intersections are for pedestrians. Cross the road only if you see these signs turn green. But look to the left and right to ensure no vehicles are approaching. Never cross the road if the sign says don't walk or if the walking man symbol turns red. Sometimes a hand symbol is used instead of a walking man or walk signals. Tell your kid about that too. If there are other symbols for pedestrians, you should make it a point to let them know. Gradually, teach your children about the other essential traffic signals they should know. 2. Stop, look and cross. Your children may have to walk to school or the bus stop and back. They may only have to cross the street after the school bus drops them off. Even if they don't, they may have to cross the street to get to a friend's house or a neighbor's. Whatever the case is, you should teach your children to cross the road safely. Here's how you can help them learn. Always look for signals and use the pedestrian crossing to cross the road. In the absence of such markings, here is what you should do. Look to your right, then look to your left and see if there are any approaching vehicles. If yes, wait for the vehicles to pass and then cross the road. Never cross at bends. Never cross between stationary vehicles. Adults should always accompany children aged less than 6 and hold their hand when crossing the street. 3. Pay attention, listen. Teach your kids that they may not always be able to see an oncoming vehicle especially if they are standing near a bend. Therefore, they should listen to know if the vehicle is approaching. Cars and other vehicles on the road often use the horn at bends and at unmanned intersections to indicate that they are nearing. Tell your children if they hear a horn, stop and look to the left and right to see if any vehicle is approaching. Listen for engine sounds nearby to know if there is a moving vehicle. Explain how a loud noise indicates the vehicle is nearby and a faint sound means it is away. 4. Don't run on roads. Children may not always have patience and may tend to run across the street to get to the other side. They may also run along the road in your neighborhood while playing. Tell your kids never to run across or along the road. Children can get distracted easily and leave their guardian's hand and run or sprint away. Teach your kids to stay calm on the road and never to run or sprint. 5. Always use sidewalks. Teach your kids to use the sidewalk when walking on the road. Set an example for them by using the walking paths yourself. Whether it is a busy street or not, encourage your kid to use the sidewalk to stay safe on the road. 6. Crossroads and pedestrian crossings. Kids have a tendency to just sprint across the street anywhere they like. That can be dangerous as passing vehicles do not slow down unless there is a signal or a crossroad. 
tell your kids to cross only at an intersection and use the pedestrian crossing. If they are in a small neighborhood where there are no crossroads or marked crossings, they should follow the rules mentioned above. Lessons on pedestrian safety for kids are important and should be included in school curriculum as well. 7. Never stick hands outside the vehicle. Kids tend to put their hands out of the school bus even when it is moving. Some of them may even put their head out and look back and wave. This is common with students taking the school bus. It may seem like a fun idea but sticking hands or heads out of moving vehicles can be highly dangerous. If children are not careful, they could be hit by vehicles approaching from the opposite direction. 8. Bends are the blind spots for motorists. When you cross at a bend, you do not give the vehicle drivers enough time to spot you and stop the car. Tell your kid never to cross at a bend as that can increase the chances of them getting hurt. 9. Staying safe on a bicycle If you have an older kid who rides his bike to school or around the neighborhood, make sure he is aware of and follows the following cycling rules to stay safe on the road. Always wear a helmet while riding a bike. Check if the bicycle is in working condition before using it. Check for brakes and light if using at night. Always use the bicycle lane. In its absence, ride the bike on extreme right or left side, whichever is right in your country, of the road and move along with traffic. Keep your eyes and ears open to make way for larger and faster vehicles behind you. Always use the light in areas with poor visibility and at night to be easily noticed by motorists. Do not allow your kids to ride a cycle on busy streets without parental supervision. 10. Staying safe inside a moving vehicle In a moving car, you can make sure that your kid is safe with the help of a car seat or seat belts. To see that they are safe in moving vehicles without you, make sure that they learn and follow these simple rules. Never stand inside a moving vehicle, especially a school van or bus. Students should not move around inside a moving school bus. Stay seated and hold on to the hard rail inside the bus for support until the vehicle comes to a stop. Do not put any part of your body outside the window of a moving vehicle. 11. Always get out at the curbside. If your kid takes the school bus every day, help them remember these safety tips. Start early and be on time to avoid running for the bus. Always stand in the queue when boarding and alighting the bus. Always get off the curbside when getting off a car or the bus to prevent being an obstruction to the other vehicles on the road. 12. Be seen, stay safe. Dressing in black may be a bad idea when you want to walk at night. It is important that vehicle drivers notice you if you want to stay safe. To be seen, wear light-colored clothes or reflective material when walking or biking at night. Wear bright-colored clothes during the day. Wave your hand if you want to indicate your presence to an incoming vehicle. Last but not the least, 13. Children can get excited and rush in an attempt to get to a place or meet someone. That can be dangerous. Teach your kids the following. Not rush when getting in or off a vehicle as it can be hazardous. Not get distracted or suddenly drag a parent or guardian in a particular direction as this can throw the adult off ground. Stay calm and do not rush when walking on the street. Not open car doors suddenly as they then get into a habit of opening the doors only after you say so. Do not play in the bus bay or on the roads. Well, those were our selection of 13 road safety pointers for your children and for you. If there is something that we might have missed, please make it a point to write it in the comments below. If you like the video, do hit the like button and don't forget to share this with people who you know are careless on the road. Make it a point to share it on WhatsApp and Facebook and with all your friends whose road safety is a constant concern for you. And hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos like this. Well, this is me Ashish David signing off. I'll see you in the next video.